The offense set for a first down play. Used the play fake, now to throw. He's gonna go for a big one. Oh, right through his hand. They came out attacking, wanted to impose their will, and they missed a big chance on that one. Last incompletion leaves them still sitting at their own 25 with second and 10. At the 35, he's open. He's run out of bounds, but a big play on that one, and it'll be a first down. Here's this offense with a fresh set of downs. The play action fake. Might be looking to run. Find space on the right. Slicing and dicing through this defense, and they've got it down to the 23. Kennesaw State coming out with another first down. Looking to move it through the air. Forced out of the pocket. Took a shot as he threw. Just couldn't find an open man. He'll get rid of it, and it'll be second down. Couldn't make the connection last time. Let's see if they throw it again. And the pass is incomplete thanks to a big hit. This drive was clicking along, but after a couple of misfires, threatening to stall out on third and ten. They keep attacking through the air. A little screen to the running back. They finally get him stopped, but what a good job by that front wall to set up the screen and create some lanes for their running back. Wants to go up top. Bought a little time, lets it go. Finds his back in the middle. Kennesaw State right back to work. On second down, just keeps firing. Can't make the grab as he was going for six right there. Well, that last incompletion is a good example of why your timing has to be so good as a quarterback because the windows, they open and they close so quickly in this part of the field. And he will be sacked at the six-yard line. Quarterback sacks is a trend that this offense would like. Guys, we're about to see this Kennesaw State offense go back to work. Always good to get points on a drive, David, but chip shot field goals can leave you a little empty. And I think it's great to get points, but the great teams get touchdowns in the red area. You gotta get out there this time and execute a little better on this drive. You're absolutely right, David. Generally, the best red zone offenses are the ones that run the ball the best. So, let's see if they can be a little bit more physical on this drive. It's complete! And he's brought down after a nice game. It's first and ten for this offense from the 42. Used the play fake, now to throw. Now sliding to his left. Throws to the wideout. Finds a man on the left. They get him on the ground, but not before he gets enough for the first down. The offense has it first and ten from the 42. We've reached the two-minute warning, and we have ourselves a ball game, and they have a chance to take the lead here before the half. They've got it. First and ten at the 42. He wants to throw. Back open in the middle. And a good job in coverage there as they stop it after just a few. Clock's running and they'll try to get to the line. Warp speed for second down. Gets it out fast. He's run out of bounds, but not before. Turning in a big pickup and moving the sticks for a first down. They're threatening to score, and they'll throw it. Unloads it left. Touchdown, Owls! And they... A first down for the offense. He's going to pass. Trying to burn this defensive back. Makes the catch on the left. Hit the afterburners, kid. And he strides his way into the end zone. Touchdown, Kennesaw State. Really nice job working the route and getting himself open. He was able to locate the football, snag it out of the air. And this guy now has five receiving touchdowns on the year. Guys, we'll get another look at this Kennesaw State offense. 
They've got time. They've got the lead. And David, it's sort of like a doctor. First, do no harm. Do no harm, but also momentum is hard to create, sometimes hard to stop. You have it, so just don't do anything stupid to create some momentum for the other side. I think a lot of this comes down to your quarterback and whether or not he's making good decisions in this game. If yes, be aggressive. If not, let's just take the lead into halftime and get ready for the second. Trying to pick up a first down. He's looking to throw on third and short. He's going to run it. We got a timeout here late in the first half, and they'll try to get more points on the board before the break. Really good job by the defense getting to the quarterback and get. They're backed up first and ten from inside their own five, and they'll try to get this drive started. Ran through the contact. Strong run there to pick up four and get it out to the seven. Solid pick up of four on first down. It's second and six. They'll run play action. Rifles it down the middle. And that deep shot's going to wind up incomplete, but we do have a flag on the field. Let's see what the official says. This defense happy with how that last play turned out. So they'll decline the penalty. Offense breaks the huddle on third down. From the gun, wants to pass. Pocket starts to collapse. And he tried to make something happen with his feet, but they stopped him short, and it'll bring up a fourth down. Great job. First down for this offense. Use the play fake. Now to throw. He's taking the shot. And he intercepts it. Looking for more room. And they'll close in on him after a good return on the interception. QB's got to pick and shoot. Guys, we're about to see this Kennesaw State offense go back to work. Well, the good news about this drive, Jesse, it can't go worse than last time through a pick on the first play. No, it certainly can't. I think one good way, David, to help your quarterback turn the page is just find him an easy completion here and let him get back into your way. Yeah, or find an easy handoff. Just hand the football off, maybe get the ground game going, maybe jumpstart this offense a little bit. Trying to escape and get it himself. Makes the tackle at the 46, but it's a 15-yard gain to get them into plus territory. These guys aren't human. I mean, they got to survey the field, throw the football, make it. And the defense will corral the quarterback, and down he goes at midfield. Time winding down in the quarter as they come to the line. Trying play action. Coming after it. Just gets rid of it to the running back underneath. They get him down, and that'll be the final play of the third period. And you want to talk about his favorite receiver, it might be everybody based on the number of guys getting touches and a chance to show off their hands in the passing game. One more period to go to see who can make the winning plays and come home with the victory. It's third down, and the line to gain is the 36. Getting some heat. Trying to make magic on the scramble. What a good one there. He has enough for the first down. Quarterback and running back set up in the pistol. Comes out throwing on first down. Quickly to the tight end. Stop is made at the 22. A 10-yard pickup and a first down just outside the red zone. These routes have some reads and adaptability built in, and the big fella found that cushion and made the play. And the rush will get to him at the 25. And the defense just gets their fourth sack of the day. And guess what? This offensive line, they gave up four last week, too. So you need some consistency up front. Make sure you protect that QB that can make those big plays for you. I just love this guy's instincts, right? When things aren't open right away, he never panics. He just understands the situation where he is on the field, and he's so confident in his own natural ability that he has the ability to run, go get the first down, keep this drive rolling. 
And if they want to take the lead, can't be thinking field goal here. They'll need a touchdown to go up in the fourth. From the gun. Quarterback doing what he does best. He can move. Throw to the end zone. Picked off. We've reached a two-minute warning in this offense, trying to milk this clock and keep time on the... Guys, we'll get another look at this Kennesaw State offense. And boy, they missed an opportunity last time throwing that pick in the red zone. You gotta put that frustration behind you. You can't turn it over. That's that's a cardinal sin. You know better than that, Jesse. You can't take points off the board. But you gotta move on. I, you do. I, I think he just got way too overeager down in, in the red zone that last drive. So just come out here, trust your reads, trust what your coaches have told you to do, and just go out next week. Trying to get everybody set with the clock still running. He'll come out throwing on first down. He'll pull it down and run. Turns it on in midfield. They finally make the stop, and he shows why he is dangerous on the run, too, and he's got a first down. Kennesaw State right back to work. Going up top on first down. Any way you can in your freshman season at quarterback, and he gets it done on the ground. Finally, some signs of life from this offense, which has done nothing in the second half. It's first and ten. Throws for the tight end. And that incomplete pass caused by the big hit on first down. Second down coming. Now second and ten. He's looking to throw. Catch in the middle. It's Daniels. He's brought down quickly. Minimal gain there. Still a bit short of the first down. They'll hurry to the line here to try to get off that third down play. From the gun, wants to pass. Going for it all. And swatted down by the defense to stop the scoring opportunity. And here we go, down a score. They'll go for it on fourth down. Scrambling away. Got some room, headed to the goal line. He almost punched it in for six. He'll get him down at the one-yard line. He's looking to throw. Quarterback now breaking the field. You don't give a hoot. Kennesaw State does. Touchdown. Got to get everybody lined up quickly. Time winding away, and they've got to push the ball down the field. He's going up top here late in the game. They fought to the bitter end, and the final incompletion puts a wrap on it. Oh, that was a pretty rough showing there by this defense. 